Hi guys, welcome back to Yorkshire Car Restorations. In this video, we're back on the NC again, the track car that isn't now a track car, it's just a show car, so we trailer it everywhere. In this video, we're gonna be addressing these side skirts. Now, I don't like on this particular car, the way the side skirts sweep in. I think on this car and the way it's gonna look, they should either be straight down or flared a little bit. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna fabricate a zone in metal. So let's grab some tools and let's crack on. Right, so as you can see, I trimmed this off. That lets us push this bar far enough back. Now, we're gonna, we're looking for straight down for now. And then if we want to, once we've got straight down and to this level, which is the bottom of the sill, we're gonna maybe put a step off it as well. Um, so now we've got this, what we're going to do is we're going to dictate the height we want to be. Now, how we're going to do that is, and again, this is right up to his tire. Uh, and this is where our original side skirts came out to. Now, as you can see this lip on the bottom, when I put this across there, there's literally five mil. Now there is quite a bit of corrosion on here and various spots. And we do know from previous videos inside this corner is completely missing. There's nothing there. So we do have to refabricate that at some point, but it's not changing the outside. There is a little hole on the bottom here that we need to plug that a grommet came out. A little hole next to it and the same over here. So we know this We're just going to look for the line we want. We can adjust it. I think we're about there. So what we're going to do from here, we know it's this much above, which brings us to this edge here. So from there, if I can get the lid off. So from there, we're going to mark just a couple of mil above there and if we cut that I 
that's about where we're going to go to straight down Okay, so this is all trial and error, but I just realized if this is the bottom of this sill here, if I want to put, then put a stepped skirt on it, on the bottom of this flared skirt, once I put a box section in there, it's gonna bring it down to here which is where I don't want. So what I do want is I want the thickness of this steel again off this. So now we've got this upright. We need to basically do the same box section but across there. But as you can see, box section won't quite fit in there it'll fit there which I'm happy with but we need to trim off these corners as well so the first thing we need to do is get a bit of box section that will fit to there and then start cutting these back so that it'll recess into there Right, so now we've got us upright and we've very vaguely got a cross section and we've left enough room here. We may trim it back a little bit to weld this bar on the end. Now what we need to do is we need to follow the profile with the square bar. Don't know how we're gonna do that. But we're gonna follow the profile of this door just to the edge of the door before the wing starts because we need to do something a little bit different where the wing is because we still need to take that wing off at some point um, just in case we need to take that wing off at some point so what we need to do now is we need to find some way of bending this box section to the profile of this door that should be fun